Hey guys, this is Jackie Portwood, your Norwex consultant. If you want to see any of these products before I talk about them or do your own research, please check out JackiePortwood.Norwex.Biz and do your own research on the different products the company has. All right, today I'm going to be doing my raw chicken swab test using an Enviro cloth. This is the backbone to the company, and all it is is a microfiber cloth that does amazing things. All right, this is damp already, and I will explain later why the Clorox wipes are out here, all right? But first, I'm going to do the test so you can see how it removes the bacteria from the surface. I will be using one of these. These are protein swabs. This is an independent company of Norwex, from Norwex, separate, and these are used in restaurant businesses to test the cleanliness of a surface to see if there's any protein, which is actually smaller than bacteria, any protein residue left on the surface, all right? So I have some raw chicken. I'm gonna take my raw chicken. I'm gonna spread it around here. You can kind of see that on the computer or on the screen right there. You can see where I spread it. All right, remember I'm wiping my yucky chicken hands on here. All right, so I'm going to take my damp cloth. I've folded it in half and then in half again. So I have a flat surface. I am going to take it and just wipe over, just turn it around and just wipe any extra up. All right, then I'm going to take this swab and I'm going to, I'm doing the outsides too. I wanna to make sure I didn't just spread the bacteria like a lot of cloths, paper towels, Clorox wipes do, all right? So spread it a bunch. Now I'm going to release the liquid which will then have a reaction if there's any residual protein found on the surface. All right, so while this is working, I'm going to chat with you about why our towel is so unique. A lot of people have problems spending this much on Norwex products. Our Enviro cloth is $16.99, and it, to me, I thought, oh my gosh, that's expensive. However, I'm gonna ask you a few questions. How much are one of those? I think I paid $3.49, and that's a small one. I think a lot of times are $5.49. You can get a pack of three or six at Costco from anywhere from oh, $9.99 to $17.99, right? That's the cost of one of these. And how long do those actually last you? The, Norw the Norwex cloths have a two-year warranty from the company, so they will do what they claim they will do for two years. All right, so what they claim they will do, unlike chemicals which kill the bacteria and um, viruses when used properly, key phrase, our towels remove bacteria from the surface. So how it does that is this is one two hundredth, each fiber, one two hundredth the size of a human hair. To be considered microfiber in the industry, it has to be one sixth the size of a human hair. So we have gone way beyond that. On top of, so because they're so small, it actually, the specialty weave acts like a claw and it is able to pick up and trap inside the fibers, the bacteria that is on a surface. So it actually removes and traps because those fibers are so tiny, it is able to pick up the smallest of particles. If you were to unravel this, it would reach from Canada all the way down to the border of, or the, to the Gulf of Mexico. All right, so super awesome technology right there. Now, the cool thing about these is a lot of the microfiber with Norwex actually has silver embedded into every fiber of the cloth. And what that does is it silver has antibacterial properties. Bacteria is not able to remain pre alive in the presence of silver. So after you're done using this with whatever you're done using it for, you're going to rinse it out in warm water, which will swell the fibers, release any of the trapped bacteria and gunk and debris down your drain, wring it out, and then you'll simply hang it for 24 hours. And because that silver is able to go into action over the course of 24 hours, you will have a clean towel that has self-purified, which means there will be no more bacteria on it, which means it won't smell because those disgusting washcloths and kitchen towels you have at your kitchen sink right now, the reason they smell is because of the bacteria. So just keep that in mind. You're just spreading more bacteria on your surface when you use it, all right? Okay, 
So we are going to look at the results. As you can see, this is green. Hopefully you can see. It's kind of hard with this lighting. I can't tell if you can tell. So on here, there's actually a green, clear, pink, and purple. And the darker, or the purple, means that there's been proteins found on the surface. This is green, all right? So there, there was no protein found, okay? And now, compare it to earlier, I used the Clorox disinfecting wipes. And it took a little bit longer for it to go into action, but as you can see, that is a darker color. If you can tell side by side, this is the Norwex cloth and this is the, the Clorox wipes. This did not disinfect for the way we use it normally. On the Clorox wipes, it says to properly disinfect, you need to let the surface remain visibly wet for four minutes. On the Lysol wipes, it says it needs to remain visibly wet for 10 minutes. None of us rarely do that. We just take a, a wipe, just wipe it, and you're done. But you're not getting the results that the package claims. All right? So as you can see, the vast difference between those, between those two. All right? Green versus that almost dark purple. All right? So I'm going to set that aside. Now I'm going to show you how these cloths actually trap the bacteria inside the fibers. It won't cross-contaminate. Okay? So I have this. This is the one that we used for the Norwex wipe. I'm going to actually take the chicken. I'm going to wipe it on here. Okay? Ugh. Okay. And then I'm going to take this same side I wiped it on. I'm actually going to wipe it on the surface. I'm going to take that same swab that I was using earlier with the Norwex, Norwex wipe. And I'm going to test to see if there's any cross contamination from the raw chicken I just rubbed on the cloth, okay? As you can see, it's still remaining green. I hope you can see. I can't tell with this lighting on the computer. So, no reaction, okay? Pretty awesome. That's because the fibers trap it inside, the bacteria inside the towel, okay? So you can literally clean your toilet and then go clean your kitchen counter and there will be no cross-contamination, which freaks me out and I can't handle it. <laughs> So I washed them anyways, but this shows that there is no cross contamination. All right. So, and just to prove this is real chicken with gross bacteria on it, I am going to take it and I'm going to swab the chicken itself to show you the reaction that you should get in the test tube when there is protein found. Okay. Sorry, it takes time. Be patient, this is way longer than I planned. All right, so you can already see it is turning purple. All right, so this is real chicken, real disgustingness, and you just saw all of this live to show you the power of what a Norwex, Norwex cloth can do with just water, all right? So think about how much you spend on paper towels. This works. I literally, I leave one, a damp one, when my kids eat breakfast and dinner. I leave it at the table and they know this is how they wash their hands. They just take it and they, they uh, like this on them. They wash their hands before they eat with this and they wash their hands after they eat. And this is what I use at my table all the time, okay? This is what you can use when your kids have the stomach flu. This is what you can use when you go camping and you don't want to use precious water. You can rinse this out in water, wring it out, you can wash your cups, you can wash your silverware. If you have a camper or a trailer, this is awesome, awesome water saving, very environmentally friendly, so you're not dumping any chemicals or soap down. You can clean uh, plates with this. You can take it uh, in a plastic baggie that's already damp with you to the store, to restaurants, so you can wipe down the rails on the shopping carts or your tables at a restaurant, your steering wheel, your phone. There's all sorts of different uses for this and it removes that bacteria so you know because of this test that you're not exposing yourself to all that bacteria or chemicals, all right? I hope this helps. I'm sorry it was a little bit long, but um, that gives you a better understanding, hopefully, of the power of these using an independent testing strip that they use in restaurants to test for bacteria, all right? 
Have a great night. Again, jackieportwood.norwex.biz. If you have any questions, you can email me. My phone number's on there. Or just check out the products and what we have to offer. Have a great night.